As the opioid epidemic continues to be an issue affecting a lot of people in Wisconsin, there's a new study out looking at whether CBD can help treat and treat those symptoms and the cravings of addiction. Here to talk more about that research is Dr. Mandira Mera from SSM Health. Good morning. Good morning. So this is a really interesting and potentially controversial topic. Yeah, anytime we talk about CBD, immediately people get very polarized. Right. Either you're very in support of CBD or you're very anti. And the truth is that until things get better regulated, we're not going to have great recommendations. But if you've just been listening to the news or really listening to the past couple of years, CBD has claimed to treat basically everything. Everything from anxiety, seizures, different types of pain. And in this case, we're talking about potential addiction. I know, uh, Josh and Leah, we've talked so much about how important the opiate epidemic right now is and how it's killing more people than even car crashes every year for the past almost five plus years. Wow. In that case, people really stop and listen when you talk about those statistics. In this case, this was an interesting study, a relatively small study, but it talked about heroin addicts and really using CBD oil, so this is very important, or CBD, the component, meaning it doesn't have that THC psychoactive component or, or the component that people are getting high off of, per se, but it has the CBD uh, part to it. So anyway, it, it administered the CBD and then did a series of tests exposed people to uh, different videos and tested if their anxiety and their cravings were lower. So compared to a placebo, the patient population or the pe population that used the CBD did have less anxiety and less cravings. So again, here's another potential benefit to possibly using that CBD oil without the psychoactive component that could possibly help curb addiction. Now what's amazing is if you look at the actual um, treatments out there right now, there's only really one or two medications, one of them's methadone that many of us are familiar with, yep. that acts still on the opiate receptor. This is something that acts on a totally different receptor and may actually curb some of those anxieties, may actually help people have uh, less of those cravings, which as we know, if we've ever tried to cut something out, even just for 40 days, really dealing with that initial craving can be half the battle, if not more. So just another really interesting potential benefit to CBD. I think there'll definitely be more studies coming out in the future that will hopefully be able to help us, you know, tie down what dosing, how will this work, who really is a great candidate for this, and then who knows, it may even have better overarching uh, addiction potential, not just for opiates. Certainly not the last time we're going to be talking about that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. Dr. Mara, thank you so much for coming in. Great to be here. All right.